I was there. I was in Syracuse. I wrestled. I didn't find out till the next morning um, that something happened. Um, I didn't hear. That's what you just said is what I heard. I heard he was hitting on a girl. Maybe his mouth was, you know, overloading and um, and he got his ass beat. Um, maybe he was drinking. I, I don't know all this. I just hear bits and pieces. I'm sure whoever's around him who was there knows blow by blow. Right. And again, more story has been piled on over the years as Shawn Michaels used to do this at every bar, but he usually had Razor Ramon and Diesel with him as well, who are, who are big backup versus Bulldog, big backup. But if he's drunk, well, how can he really help you? And if X-Pac's there, he's a little smaller at the time, one, two, well, three kid. So it's like, I love them both. And they're both tough <clears throat> bastards probably. But yet when I'm drunk so, and you push me over, I will fall over. The one guy you want to worry about is Kevin Nash. Oh, I bet. Yeah, he could go. He's from Detroit, and he can clean house. I bet. So that's the one. He, I, I don't know about amateur background in wrestling. All I know, you know, the Steiners, of course, Kurt Angle, Brock Lesnar, and, and different people in amateur ranks. I don't know that bound. I just heard he was pretty badass. But I like Kevin. Got along with him. He's a great jokester. He's, he's funny as hell, and he's pretty damn smart. 